Hello, how are you guys doing? I hope you guys are having a great day so far. But today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install NC loading screens. Before we start, make sure you guys like and subscribe and join the Discord for any support because we have some of the greatest developers and Trace is the best 5M developer in my opinion. So let's just go ahead and get straight started with this video. So we're going to go ahead and hit download zip. Once it's downloaded, we're going to open it up. We're going to drag it to the side of our screen right here. Now we're going to open our 5M server files. If you follow the previous tutorials, you would have a add-ons core and stream. So you're just going to go up to your core because this is where I would put it if I was you. you. Rename and remove the dash main. Now this might happen sometimes. Just hit escape and now just rename dash main enter. Now we're going to go ahead and close this old file out. Go inside of here. Now we have a couple different things in here that we can do. Here we go into our assets. We're going into our medium and here are different logos and song that we need. So we're going to go into photo, Photopia. Now we're just going to hit start using. And right here we're going to drop and we're going to drop any, you know, we're going to drop these files right here. Go ahead and drop the logo file. And now we're just going to add a layer of the, you know, the picture that we want to use for our logo. So just go ahead and do that now and make sure you bring it to the front. So as you guys see, I just did that now. And you can just delete the background, honestly, because you don't need that anymore. And now that's simple. So now you're just going to do, see how it says logo PNG, you want to make sure it does. And then new, you don't have to do anything with that. You're just going to um, go ahead and, you know, save it. So we're just going to go ahead and go down to save, save changes. And now we're going to, we can also do export as PNG logo. See how it was already done is because I had saved it, but we're just going to make sure it's replaced. And now we're just going to do this with all of the different types. So the regular transparent logo and the field logo. So let's just do that now. Alright, now that all three are in there, we're going to go ahead and get our song as well. So our song is put in right there. And once we have our song, now we're just going to go ahead and hear our little props that you guys can change as well. But we're not going to be changing that today, in this video at least. If you guys need help changing that, of course, you guys can leave a comment or join the Discord. But now let's go ahead and open scripts. We're going to go to our config. Going to hit open. Um, right here, you're going to put your, your server IP. Um, I'm not going to put mine right now, but this is where you're going to put your server IP. Then right here, you're going to do, you know, your Discord. So we're just going to go ahead and open our Discord. So make sure it is never expiring. That way, um, you're players can join but if you have a custom link you're just going to do the custom link which is just trace in our case then we're going to open youtube we're going to do this for the instagram link but um because i'd much rather do the youtube one than the instagram one but if you guys have an instagram you guys can do that as well so we're just going to go ahead and add the trace youtube instead of instagram so right there as you guys can see it said instagram label right so so for the name i suggest leaving it instagram and then the label you guys can change it to youtube and then you know you guys can change the png and whatever so but that's super simple if you guys need help again just feel free to go in the discord or leave a comment either way i'll help you guys so we're just going to go ahead and visit the store as well because that's what we're going to add for the tebex again you guys can change all the pngs anything that you guys want make sure that you guys are at the home of your tebex or at the home of the tebex or really any store that you guys want to link go ahead and save it now go into our config and then just put the link there now now right here we have the owner and um the dev so right here we're going to edit this i want to let you guys know now that the discord app.com image you have to guys have to paste it as i'm going to show you guys in this video um so mine did not work in this video but just be aware that you guys will event 
most likely work sometimes you know the discord link is broken so if you guys want to know how to make sure that your discord link is not broken i'm going to be leaving a comment down below there's going to be a certain thing that it needs to have and once it does as you guys can see right here so this link i checked it but it doesn't have that thing that it needs but you know it didn't really matter at the time because you know i'm just trying to get the tutorial out but in the comments i'm going to be leaving exactly what needs to be part of your link so that you can make sure that it works so now that we're all done with this you guys can add a category and you know the song file but i suggest you guys don't touch any of that so now we're going to go ahead and go back to our five of server we're going to open our resources and then open our core and then open the nc loading so right now we're going to go ahead and keep looking um for any uh, anything else that you guys want to look around but right now we're just going to go ahead and open our index and this is what we're going to be editing now so you guys can see right there's index as at the main and there's different things you guys can change. So first thing right here, title, you guys can change that. Um, the date, you don't have to change the state, date or anything like that, but you guys should change the title. Um, there is some things that, I'm, that I've missed, but make sure you guys go through this thoroughly to make sure everything's working. If you guys have any questions whatsoever, I'm willing to help everyone and just make sure that you guys ask for help if you need it because I remember starting and it was very difficult. But as you guys see me right here, I'm just um, adding the description, adding what I want to have for it. So right now I'm just going to put hello, welcome, or you could also put something um, like like I am. So if you were making a server, you know, you would put hello, welcome, but right now I'm just going to put subscribe to Trace. Um, All the logos and things like that, you guys can edit here, but I suggest you just keep it because we, we replaced it for a reason. So anything you guys want to change right here, I mean, you can, but honestly, I suggest you don't. So we're just going to hit file and save all. So make sure you guys restart your server and let's go check it out inside the server loading up. All right. Now we're here and the server's all restarted. We're going to go ahead and connect. And as you guys can see, it's working. The music is working. But as you guys can also see, I did miss the little part where it said NCRP, but right there it does say subscribe to Trace. You guys may be thinking, oh, it looks bad. It doesn't actually look bad. It's just the graphics pack that I use. So as you guys can see, like I told you earlier, it didn't work for me, but I definitely will be helping you guys in the comments to make sure that you guys' work. So right there, you can, you know, stop it, you know, top right, Trace Dev um the day everything everything works everything is very fantastic i'm letting you guys know now um there might be a warning in your server in your server log or in your f8 console or your server console i meant um but don't worry because everything works perfectly fine your server works fine you know my server looks a little weird to you maybe but it's just because of my graphics pack um but as you guys can see everything works everything works perfectly right here you guys have that but that is not a problem whatsoever. If it does become a problem, feel free to ask for help in the Discord or in the comments. But that's pretty much all for this video. I really appreciate you guys watching this. You know, I'm just trying to help all these new upcoming developers. If you guys have any questions whatsoever, feel free to let me know or feel free to let the other developers know. Have a great day.